Organized labor has challenged political leaders to take a cue from the selfless and resilient posture of Nigerian workers. At a public presentation of a book on NLC's 40 years of struggles, the federal government hinted it is adjusting workers' wages in view of rising inflation. Senior correspondent Joka Adisa has details. This public presentation of a book that chronicles the years of struggles is spearheaded by organized labor and brings together Nigerian leaders across political divides. The prolonged strike of university teachers, rising inflation, and the corruption associated with the IPPIS take the lead as discussions open. The NLC president identifies the many gains of labor struggles and the pain of hardships the average worker bears daily. In the more than 40 years of the reorganization of the NLC, as we know it today, we have been the buffer between ordinary Nigerians and excruciating hardship. We have stood behind successive governments and the imposition of very extreme living conditions. The government on its part argues that the spike in inflation is global and it is attending to the resultant challenges. The 2019 Minimum Wage Act now have a clause for review. There must be an adjustment of wages to reflect what is happening in the economy. It does not foreclose an out-of-the-court settlement with ASO. Other speakers commend NLC for putting the 247-page publication together for posterity. This is the chance to interrogate everyone. Don't look at who is handsome, who is not handsome. Look at handsome ideas and ugly ideas. We hereby ask the government that today take that first subsidy and probe it because we are questioning the volume that you say we are consuming. If you probe it, and you say that extra volume, I can tell you that the money you are going to realize from it can send ASU back to classroom tomorrow morning. This publication, Contemporary History of Working Class Struggles, is scheduled to be distributed across all libraries and schools in Nigeria, as the Nigeria Labor Congress hopes that students and indeed every citizen will be enriched with knowledge of labor struggles and what the future holds. Jokia, TVC News, Abuja.